Hello, welcome back to Skimming the Pages. Yeah, Whew, the, hello. The, the only book and gaming comment show on YouTube. There might be one somewhere else, I don't know. That'd be strange. Well, I've never Googled it, so I guess we'd have to look it up, and I'm not going to. No one else look it up either. It's okay. competition. Don't give them views. If there's another book in gaming, and go dox them. Someone, <laughs> don't, don't do that. Someone re <laughs> reacts to our comment show. Yeah, they comment on our comments to the comments. <laughs> yeah. I mean, oh, that's, man. That's just getting real meta with it. So this is our uh, first comment show back in the new year. Yeah, new year, same anxiety. Yes, same issues. But well, better audio. Better audio, we that's did, right. We did fix the audio problem, so there's that. We, we no longer have any episodes to upload that have the terrible echoey audio. Right. So let's keep it that way. Let's hope nothing new happens. Right. Well, it's been... Oh, God, it's been... So it's been a long time since we've done one of these. Yeah. I forgot how to do it. Should I we don't... shout out people? Let's shout out people. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that first. Here's our uh, um, our great Phil's, our, our patron. Yeah. Not, not Phil's, just Phil. Yes. Plural is Phil. Um, we got we got Hey Jason. <laughs> we got Winneapolis, Talish Verda, uh, Phil, and uh, Rad Coffee Man. Yeah! Love you guys. Those are our, best. our, our patrons who get special shout out. Yeah, get special shout out. Get to pick segs. Yeah, which we're we're working on that. Like we're working on setting up a system for that. We're also we've also got like I know we mention this every time, but the sticker situation. Like we're getting it set up to where we can just like post an entire year of them. Yep. And then just like have them. So if you're like if you stay, we got one more sticker to make. Yeah. If you if you stay a patron for the entire year, you end up getting all of them. Cause I think, I think even that's you, how it works. Yeah, if you join like late, you have to be a patron for like three months. It's it was three months to get the otaku sticker to get the first one. So like if you join like part way into the year, you probably wouldn't get the old ones. I don't know. And it's one of those things. Like I don't know <laughs> if we're gonna do like exclusivity where it's like oh we we'll never bring this back or if like someday we'll be like oh, let's do the otaku one but then the people <laughs> right. who did stick around they're like i already have the i otaku already got one. an yeah. otaku what am i gonna do with it Stupid. i need another one <laughs> i mean hopefully someday we can get to a point where we do like i would just t-shirts or something yeah i would change it somehow give them a different facial expression or something right or put some text around it or yeah, yeah we'll, censorship we'll sort it out <laughs> um so yeah we haven't done this we haven't done a comment show in forever because we were doing segments and whatnot. So this one's probably going to be pretty long. Yay! Because there's a lot of comments. And we need to do a call to action type of deal. So my thought was, in the comments, tell us, like... Because we did, like, last year was a huge year for our channel. Like, comparatively to other years. Like, we had yeah. a, a ton of growth. We we kept consistent on everything. We, I mean, we started a bunch of different stuff. Right. Like Much did, growth. Very, I don't know. <laughs> very big boy. <laughs> big boy. Big boy energy. <laughs> yeah. We got that big boy energy. But uh, just a, what is something like you guys, like your favorite thing from this channel from last year, whether that be like a playthrough, a seg, a series, a new game we played, a a specific video, a specific moment, just like Otaku joke. Tuesday in general. <laughs> yeah, like like a running joke we did, like anything. Like, like, do you have something like that that like you're like, oh, that was like my favorite thing from last year? Can you think of something? Do I? Yeah, I probably could have like told you this beforehand. Yeah, so I don't about know. It. I, uh, um, Super Mario Sunshine. Yeah, it was a good one. Um, <clears throat> I don't know. Yeah, I mine's probably <laughs> this, like the comment because we started the comment, comment show, show yeah. like. I like, because we had played around with it, just, I was reading comments in just random videos when I was bored. <laughs> right. And I was like, you know, let's just do like an actual comment show. Yeah. Because we had stopped doing the podcast and all that. So I, I just, I like this because it, you know, it, it brings us closer together with our fan base. Even right. though there's I like probably to... a lot of people don't watch these. Uh, it's, it's, it does people decent, do. I guess. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, it's a, that's our call to action for today is... Just what was your favorite, favorite thing? Anything, book and anything gaming. from yeah, book and gaming moment, playthrough, joke, anything. Yeah, and maybe we'll uh, play it or something, or like do a compilation if we get enough of them. <laughs> <laughs> right, <laughs> best of the year. Even though we haven't finished all the best stubs for the other months, nope. Like we still got to do lagging behind on that now. Yeah, well, we've been busy with segments and like it's just end of the year stuff is always insane. Yeah. Okay, so let's let's get down to the nitty gritty. 
unless you got anything else to say. Um, no. Okay. <laughs> Check out our <laughs> Patreon. Yeah. Obviously. I'm on it a lot. Discord. That's Discord. I mean, uh, yeah. <laughs> You're Discord. on Discord a lot. Yeah, I was going <laughs> to say, also, we have a Discord. Go check that out. They've, they've been organizing watch parties That's right. recently. Like they, did, I think it was just last night. It was like the second one where you all watched... Uh, We're watching the wonderful uh, Viz English dub of Sailor Moon. Yeah. So if you, you know, I haven't shown up to one yet, but I, I'll pop in if I ever, you know, if they're ever one that it's like, oh, I can actually get on and chat. Right. Because it's like voice chat, like you guys do. It's well, in the voice channel. We're right? all, yeah, we're all muted, but we. Oh, you are. Yeah, you we're not talking talk? to each other. What? Why not? There's a chat. We well, use. Just, no, just we, talk to each other. We use our keyboards. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna hop on there and just start like talking out loud and annoying. <laughs> hey. Stop talking over the show. Hey, hey guys. <laughs> <laughs> what are we watching? This is stupid. <laughs> I oh, like Sailor Mercury. <laughs> Put SpongeBob on. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now now that we're you know we've vamped for a certain amount of time, let's start the comments. Okay. So going all the way back to skimming the pages from November twentieth. I like that one. With, that's the one with Ram <laughs> saying that's why you like it. Uh, Catherine says it's nice that Catawa is getting more players slash viewers again. It's a great game. It's a great game. Yes, I agree. Yeah, because that was like in that one we were talking about the huge boost we got. It's funny, like I was looking at the analytics from last year. Mm-hmm. I mean, <laughs> this year we're recording this, and it's it's actually the thirty first, right? Yeah, <laughs> but uh, I was looking at the analytics, and like it was like October thirtieth. It was like uh, the oh. second to last day yeah. of the Halloween thing, Spook and Gaming, and we just had this huge boost in like views and subscribers, and it was all because of that that trash taste thing we were, we talked about it was just we like got a, we got like 100 subscribers that month yeah it was just like mostly all in one day too yeah it's like god some more people need to shout us out so there <laughs> yeah. there's there's your job like not here's another call to action go to other people and bother <laughs> them to go shout us out because that won't get us you know blacklisted that's by not people. annoying or anything yeah, yeah don't don't actually do that i don't recommend doing it but if you do it i just Pretend like I didn't say that. Just do it on your own accord. <laughs> um, the Blekadet says, timestamp, I think Japanese people would just omit the X. Okay, so Spy X family yeah. is just Spy family. Yeah, because we were trying to figure out if it's like Spy and family. You just spy asked like with how, family. yeah, right. And then you responded, that's what I've heard it is, but that makes it even more confusing. That sounds like the whole family are spies. Are All they right. not? And they're not. Spoilers! I guess a little no, not really, but... No, they all have things that they keep secret. I just assumed it from was each like, other. I fe- I just assumed it was an anime version of Mr. and Mrs. Smith, Mm-mm. the Angelina <laughs> Jolie Brad Pitt. <laughs> yeah, thing, where it's like they're both secretly spies, but I they mean, don't know it. Yeah, I, and s- spoilers, I guess. But yeah, he's the spy. Oh, okay. she's an assassin. Oh, yeah. And the little girl has um, mind reading. Oh, but they all keep it secret from each other. Right. So nobody knows anything. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's it's popular. I just I I've never I'm not an anime boy. I am, but I'm not. I'm <laughs> right. Ve- I'm very casual anime. Uh, the Black Dead then responds to you says it's just a stylistic choice most of the time. Other quirk of the culture. So that's that's why there's X in a lot of things like Hunter X Hunter and mm-hmm. see I've always thought like Hunter X Hunter I was like oh that's like Hunter versus Hunter or you know like, yeah it's just like. Putting an it's just like an Xbox gamer tag. <laughs> I guess you're not yeah. supposed to read the X's. They don't want to put a space or a weird symbol. They don't. Yeah. They don't like other symbols. They just put an X. They don't like the and X's symbol. are cool. <laughs> <laughs> Spy and family. Yeah, I'm, I'm zombie cow, but with an X. <laughs> what a loser! It's because the Z was taken. Bookend X gaming. Yeah, well, that's time to change it. Yeah, let's just rebrand five years in. <laughs> just to Six throw an X in, in there. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, so not ballin'. Katawa Shoujo Shizune route episode sixteen. Oh God. Uh, oh no. Kinga Navingiao. Yeah. I don't know if you pronounce that Z or not because I don't know what that little symbol is. Just put an X in it. Uh, he says, <laughs> "Your Honor, Hasao will never be ballin'." <laughs> okay, yeah. I I do remember that. You were definitely not ballin'. <laughs> yeah. Uh, thinking with the wrong head. Cadwa Shoujo episode 19. <laughs> John Hammond. <laughs> it's John Hammond. Yeah. It's even a picture of John Hammond. 
<laughs> it says late AF, but as someone who is not Japanese and does not claim to actually know anything about their culture and protocols, but I've also always assumed that the reason for the high fencing on school roofs was, is twofold, both for general safety, but also to prevent suicide, as you all mentioned. But as I said, just my assumption, don't use me as a reference. <laughs> right. Yeah, I think like I had mentioned in that episode, it was like you always see that in animes and stuff. Yeah. And I think that is like a Japanese thing, because I guess the, I think the suicide rate in Japan is like way higher than other places. Yeah. So it's, it's all like every building they have has that high fencing. I, right. People just hang out on the roof. I was going to say, time. it seems like they all they have access to the roof. So yeah, it's just that's it's a, just thing a that safety thing. Kids do is just hang out on roofs. Roofs? Roofs? Roofs. The roofs, roofs of my <laughs> roofs. mouth. <laughs> Roofs? It's roofs. Yeah. But I just, I, I, it's like hoof. Hoofs. Ho- hooves. And hooves. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> morning of the festival, Katawa Shoujo, episode 23. John Hammond, again, says, The soba booth was slinging noodles, but Hassau was slinging shade. <laughs> 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 I don't know what that's referencing, but I'm going to assume it's true. The Lily was at a soba booth. I don't, but yeah, I don't know what that's mentioning. Yeah, either. I had no idea. Uh, in Egregious Error, Mega Man 2, Thomas the Crunk Engine said, timestamp me internally when I attempt to talk to an attractive woman. Do we need to click this one? I don't think so, because it's the first, like, 20 seconds that I remember editing this, and it's okay. literally me, like, I curse right away, you get on me about it, and then, like, I immediately get into a situation where I can't escape a bunch of bullets, and I'm like, I've made an egregious error! <laughs> okay. And that's that's why I named it that, so it's, it's just him saying, like, he's terrible with women. It's, right. <laughs> I get that. I, I understand. It's big mood. Indeed. <laughs> uh, ex-girlfriends, Katawa Shoujo. We're going to have a lot Ooh. of Katawa comments because this is, like I said, it's when we had that fucking Katawa glow yeah. up. Yeah, this is a big one. Yeah, Katawa Shoujo, Shizune Route, Episode 1. Oh, God. Pro tip, John Hammond. Mm-hmm. Pro tip for anyone who may want slash need it. Also, spoilers, but if you care, why are you watching this? Yeah, jeez. What? <laughs> <laughs> You can choose to pursue both the Shizune and Lily and Hanako routes at the same time, up to Lunch Evolution Theory, the scene with the last choice in this episode. If you play your cards right, there are three choices that give you points for each path with, with one of the choices shared between them, Only, you, but you only need two points in each path to get their choice in the L.E.T. choice, making what you choose for the shared choice, that's saying choice a lot, irrelevant. All you need to do is introduce yourself, play aggressively, say sorry to Hanako, and finally admit that Hanako is cute. This is the latest possible last I'm assuming, possible place for you to still be capable of getting every route of the game. And if you are planning on doing multiple runs of the game, I'd highly recommend dropping a save at this point. Getting to skip the first chunk makes skip, skipping through the first act less of a slog. Kind of like saving right before exiting the tutorial yeah. dungeon in Oblivion. <laughs> Yeah, I so mean... So he's saying, like, you can still get all the girls from that point. Yeah, you still, like, you you only have to do a couple choices. Because we, I mean, we did this years ago, but in the first episode of all the routes, we were just, like, quick skipping everything until we ran into something new. Right. Because there was certain things, like, yeah, we would make the wrong choices on things, but you would get different dialogues. I remember being That's like, right. oh, wait, don't skip this. Yeah. Because this is different. So, Since I mean... Since it just auto-stopped when there, there was a new line of dialogue right we just did that and yeah. then would read the yeah so i mean that's that's a good that's a good tip for anyone who's like starting out in Kadawa and it, but i mean we've already done it so we can't really go back and fix that but thanks for the advice john <laughs> go make your park uh <laughs> flat is justice paper mario thousand year door thomas the crunk engine says miss meows gets put into the jar oh come on dude <laughs> <laughs> and then thomas the crunk and then again he comments and Timestamps. I'm mad at you because you don't exclusively play anime games. Yeah, that I think that was us just being like, "Hey, yell at us for some reason we, or we, something." We said something about, "Yeah, there, we, you guys don't yell at us, and right. or we're not famous enough yet for we don't get to be yelled at, so yell at us." Well, or, yeah, stay tuned because there is a comment coming up that is one of my favorite comments ever, <laughs> and it's it's it. There's a little <clears throat> bit of shade laced into it, so can't wait. Yeah, sorry, I was taking a drink. I'm talking a lot. I do that. Uh, single episode games, you suck at parking. Thomas the Crunk Engine timestamp. I would imagine that's <laughs> probably called something like a repulsion field. I don't. That one you might need. Um. To... Uh. No, you were. We were asking like, what's the opposite of a, like a tractor beam? Oh. <clears throat> yeah. Okay. Is, there, is there like a name for that? And then yeah, that's what that I, was. Okay. Yeah, because then you re- respond and said a beam <laughs> that is repulsive is just an Eric beam. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> he, he says, damn, you really just threw that man under a bus and then pour, purpet, purpet salt. <laughs> I'm guessing poured salt on his flattened body. Yeah, but that I was, he says that, but like that was me. It that was definitely it. you. That's the thing. It just, just in the future, if there is a comment from our channel, 99% of the time it's going to be beam. Yeah. And if it's not, I'll usually put like dash T. You put a T. Yeah. Just so you know that it is me because <laughs> I have responded to things. Spoiler alert for a future comment I do respond to. It's that one that has shade. <laughs> uh, let's see here. That's a big question. Kadwa Shoujo, Hanako Route, episode 42. Leaf uh, Plays says, For some reason I keep hearing the Minecraft music and now I'm recognizing it. I can't stop recognizing it. I mean, it's, yeah, I don't know. It's just m- melodic, plinky music in the background. Piano music, yeah. Yeah. You will never escape the Minecraft music. It's the best good time uh best of book and gaming july and august 2022 thomas the crunk engine says i love how travis cussed out luigi like he was joe pesci and literally any <laughs> movie he's in absolutely priceless like cussed out luigi i know is oh yeah okay is that, that the one where i'm trying that, to like speed run that's the one where you're like you fucking italian pete whatever a plumber piece of shit or whatever <laughs> you say it <laughs> remember that i is i, I remember the I'll, I'll, we were playing the first mario and like i kept saying like fuck in the exact same inclination every time i fell yeah i think that's what it is like where i'm trying to just like um, i'm gonna speed run this because this is this this is level. the one where at the end you were trying to speed run that yeah level. yeah because it was like we had still had time. You beat the game, but it was like we don't. We this episode yeah. isn't long enough. Let me try to like finish this level without stop running. Right. To hilarious results. It was pretty good. I'll see if I can find the. Yeah, you got to skip that you, ad first. I, I yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you can keep. You can go on. Okay. Uh, outdated surveys. Family Feud. Xbox One. Jordan W says, <laughs> "Well, it's a video game, so if you go from a lot and do I'm over and over again." Well, of course, it's outdated, as you can see. What? What? What now? What? Well, it's a video game. So if you, <laughs> so if you go from a lot and do I'm... Hang on. I have to... I, <laughs> oh, I, God. I was going to say, I'm off the comments I'm allergic now, to so that I, comment. I don't know. Okay, well, let me read this slowly to you. Okay, what video is it on? Outdated surveys, Family Feud. It's the third episode of the Xbox version of Family oh, Feud. Oh, okay. The one that was like, play 1v1. Right. Well, it's a video game. So if you go from a lot and do I'm over and over again, well, of course it's outdated, as you can see. Let me try to oh. let me try to translate this. Okay. Well, it's a video game, so if you go from a lot, if you play it a lot and play it over and over again, of course it's outdated. Well, I mean, we but we were talking about the outdated video game, yeah. the outdated answers. I think in maybe that he thought that we were complaining that we were getting the same questions or something. But I don't think we did. It was just that, like, we were getting questions that were like, "Name something that would suck if you lost it," and cell phone wasn't one of the answers. And it's like, yeah, okay. Because we were talking about the outdated answers. Yeah, and... it was just one of those things. Like, they definitely pulled the surveys from like old shows or other games. That's what it seemed like. Yes, because it was like all the answers were things from like the early '90s and shit. It's like this isn't current, but the game just came out. Like, it's not that old. I mean, it's not just came out, but you got that. I think, I think I got it. Yeah. Okay. Let's 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 hear that before I read the next. Okay. okay. Oh, oh. I always worry this is gonna sound. Wow. <laughs> I wonder how many. Jump years. again, you dumb fucking piece of shit <laughs> Italian cocksucker. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. 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 <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember that, but <laughs> it does have Joe Pesci energy. <laughs> yeah. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> all right uh rating women but acceptable video game waifu <laughs> tier list this one that's video came out a while ago because i think that's the first one kazuha Ka- kazua Ka- kazuha says good stuff good stuff <laughs> <laughs> thanks bud i love those comments that are just like great yeah good job oh gaming <laughs> 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 so, <thanks>. gaming gaming <laughs> yeah Straight and to the point. Uh, Super Right Brothers, Paper Mario, Thousand Year Door. Cans says, been catching up with this series. Very enjoyable, I do say. Thank you. Thanks, Cans. Yeah. Uh, Whose Shoes, Blue's Clues. <laughs> That's hard to say. It's like a tongue twister. Rampa, episode 39. Drusko Leshy says, Woot Woot Tuesday. 
<laughs> people do love their Tuesdays. I think it's here. always them that says that too. They, like, yeah, they're, Tuesday they're just sitting around we, waiting for Tuesday. We pointed it out, and now I think they say it every time. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's weird because which this may be skewed, but I was looking at, like I said, I was looking at analytics earlier today, and you can check like when most of your subscribers are on, like watching yeah. your stuff. Right. And it was like Tuesday, obviously. It was like Tuesday evening, but mm-hmm. then. The other highest was like Sunday afternoon, okay. and I'm wondering if that was skewed because that day that I said oh. we had all those was a Sunday. Yeah, so it was that's probably skewed the numbers a bit. Because I was like, "What the hell do we, we usually don't up like Sundays? Usually like the yeah, just throw whatever in here or the comment. It show. could be the comment show, possibly. But I feel like it was probably <clears> skewed <throat> because it was it, it it did include that Sunday that right. had like it could be that. plus eighty subscribers or whatever <clears throat> the hell it was. Uh, what a casual Mega Man Two, Thomas the Crunk Engine, Timestamp and Iron Sharpens Iron, so one man sharpens another. Proverbs twenty seven <laughs> seventeen. Okay. All right. Yeah, it was just us talking about Metal Man. Is like I switched to Metal Man against Metal Man and oh, killed yeah. him in one hit. And it's like, yeah, that makes sense. He's, He's weak to weak himself. Weak to himself. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I keep taking drinks. I'm sorry. Uh, they're the same picture. Dong and Rampa episode twenty eight. <laughs> Valtiel says, as a fat piece of shit myself, <laughs> the fat shaming on this episode was delicious. <laughs> I, don't, I don't remember right. doing that. <laughs> I don't either. I hope it wasn't us, but if, if it was, if I'm fat shaming, it's because I'm making fun of my own fatness. <laughs> so it's okay. I was, Yeah, I don't remember either. Like, I feel like the game probably did it, maybe towards... Uh, maybe. Oh, yeah, because it kept like um, making fun of Hifumi. Not making fun of, but like... Saying how huge he is. Oh, yeah. Was that the one where they couldn't get him up the stairs or whatever? Yeah, well, he walked up the stairs himself. Well, yeah, but I mean, they were like, there's no way you could drag that fat piece of shit up the (laughs) stairs. Yeah, yeah, that's probably what it was. Maybe maybe that. But I I still don't know why there's just randomly two uh, Monokumas. Oh, yeah. It was just like, okay. (laughs) Because it's Monokuma. He's just weird. Yeah. Uh, The Possimpable. Dong and Rampa episode twenty nine. Valtiel says, "Forgot how annoying this trial is. At least you guys make it bearable." Yeah, that's the one. That's... It's during the Hifumi. Yeah, but it's definitely the Hifumi one because that's the one that's like convoluted for the sake of being convoluted. Right. Uh, get banana aid. Garfield <laughs> lasagna party. Thomas Crunk Engine says, "New drinking game. After some NPC bullshit happens, take a shot." Oh my god. If you plan on driving home afterwards? I would not recommend it. That'd be every turn. Yeah, that it game was. was bullshit. That's so funny though cuz we <laughs> like I mean spoilers for this these episodes that not many people watched. But like we spend four episodes of that game just bitching and complaining about the computer's <laughs> cheating it the is. entire time we're winning. And then we get first and second. <laughs> yeah. Like there is never a point where we're losing but the entire time we're just like this game is fucking bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I don't know what. I think we just we're just used to being like, nah, fuck the computers. Right. Well, they were cheating. Of course, they always do. Uh, cookie collectors, Pac Man Party, episode one. Party games. Matt Barker says, as a Pac Man Party connoisseur, I can confidently say that Roger and Clyde are the best characters. So good job on that one. Yeah. Oh, is that who? That's who we went up against, isn't it? Yeah, because we were the cat and um, we were the female ghost. Yeah. Right. So Roger and Clyde were like the computers that we picked. So I guess he liked our choices, even right. though we like teamed up on Clyde and multiple I th- times. I think those videos actually did like really well, at least for us. Those, yeah, I mean, compared to Mario Party, Mario Party was, never does well, and I always want to play it. It seems like that was a pretty loved game when I'd never even heard of it. Right, yeah, no. I had no idea. <coughs> uh, my tiny little game. <laughs> it takes two. Uh, Timestamp, that's why it's fictional. There's no such thing as a female engineer. I speak from experience. Wow. <laughs> All right there, Thomas. <laughs> yeah, maybe there's not many female engineers because you're not being very inclusive there, but <laughs> Do we do we need to play that one? No. I it's I I think I know. Did you Cause, make... Well, cuz we were talking about like <laughs> the girl's room the dad in that game was like, yeah, I made all of this stuff. And it's like super intricate. And we're like, holy shit, he should have been an engineer. <laughs> like, yeah, right. Because it was like he made all this stuff. It was like, I thought she was the engineer. But yeah, it's females can be engineers. Shut up. <laughs> 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 Sorry, Thomas. I had to crack down on you right. a little bit. They can drive trains if they want to. Yeah. They could leave their friends behind. <laughs> all network, no play. Rampa episode 36. Valtail says, I guess Sakura lost the will to live. Spoilers. Oh, no. (laughs) (laughs) 
Uh, Whose Shoes, Blue's Clues, Stung and Rump, episode 39, Voltaire says, everyone just wanted to fucking die in this. Sakura was done with this nonsense. Yeah, I mean, we're kind of there, too, playing the game. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's fine. We're just, we're ready to play another visual novel. Like, we're having a good time with Danganronpa. Yeah, I love Danganronpa. But, like, when it popped up that thing that's like, you're about halfway through the game now, we're like, <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we can't get to anything else for, like, half a year now. Right. Which, that's just the way it goes when you're doing a, you know, 40-hour visual novel once a week. Yeah. It's, 45 it's, minutes at a time. Yeah, it's it, <laughs> you're going to end up taking 40 weeks to play it. Uh, Crump 2024, Paper Mario, The Thousand Year Door. Valtteo, wow, Valtteo went on a tear. Mm-hmm. I was 14 when I played this for the first time. Then a couple of times more through the years. It's going to be a blast seeing your playthrough, guys, especially with your wonderful VA. Yeah, we are the greatest voice yeah, actor. It's, is. Yeah, it's not like we take like <laughs> month-long breaks between recording and forget every single voice we've done for every single character. It happens it's every fine. time. We'll just change it up. Except for Luigi. <laughs> yeah, it's not like we're, we're consistent with any voices. So it's nah. Fine. Speaking of Luigi, Luigi the Heckler. Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. Valtiel, once again, says, I've been out of the loop for a while. I really needed my dose of BG. <laughs> well, we're always here. We're, we're always ready to give you a shot in the mouth. <laughs> Sorry. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> of content, obviously. It's tangy. Salty content. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, that, that, that YouTube channel's got to exist, right? Salty content. Salty content, yeah. yeah. Eat more pineapple. <laughs> Whatever, I'll eat pizza. Deprecation <laughs> by proxy. Paper Mario, a thousand year door. Fall tail once again. If liking your comedy makes me stupid, then I'm proud of it. I love your <laughs> shitty humor, guys. Well, I'm glad. We must, yeah, we must have said something like, "If you like us, you're yeah, how, stupid." Yeah, how can you actually like us? We're not. We're not clever. Yeah, we're always. I mean, it's deprecation. Deprecation. Yeah. Self-deprecation. Flat is justice. Paper Mario. Valtail again, you should be using Goombella because, oh, this is, yeah, like, okay, so this was the episode where it was, like, start making fun of us. Yeah, you should be using Goombella because starting battles with her is more efficient. You clearly don't know what you're doing, book and gaming, question mark? More like lame gaming. (laughs) Haha, got him. (laughs) I felt like a Fortnite player. Ugh, I need a batch? Probably a bath. <laughs> a batch. A fresh batch of BG a, juice. A, a, yeah, a fresh batch of salty content. Yeah. <laughs> Coming at you with a fresh batch of salty content. <laughs> it's your boy. Here it comes. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> content. Super right, brothers. Uh, Voltael. That was a very interesting bit about the paper airplanes. Never wondered that. Good to know. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. That was was, a teaching time with Travis. It was, because I was trying to figure out which came first. Right. I mean... And it was uh, paper airplanes. Yeah. But they were whatever. They weren't called paper airplanes. They were like paper pigeons or some weird thing like that. Paper crumpled up ball. Yeah, it was just some... I think it was like some kind of bird or something. Uh, Then the last skimming the pages uh, from 12-4. Jeez, it's almost been an entire month since we did one of these. Mm -hmm. The Black Adet. I guess it will be because this isn't getting uploaded until yeah, yeah. right. Black Adet says I kind of like pineapple on pizza actually, and other unusual toppings like seafood. That, yeah, was, our that was our call to action. action. Do you like pineapple I was like, pizza? I don't know, pineapple on pizza. Yeah, because it's delicious. It is. And Black Adet kind of likes it, and like seafood. What's seafood? Anchovies. Uh, anchovies is kind of what I would. I guess you could put like shrimp on pizza. Well, it yeah, seems I don't odd, know. but I mean, it might be good. And then Thomas the Crunk Engine, in response to the pineapple on pizza question, fuck no, that shit is an affront to the Italian people and will get you publicly beaten in Italy. <laughs> Italian pizza is disgusting. I'll die on that hill. Oh, man. Italian pizza is like all sauce and no cheese. And that makes Danny a dull boy. <laughs> <laughs> Does it it's... have any, like, octopus stuff in it? No, no. It's it's like just it's pizza, but it's not American pizza is, you know, American, so it's like covered in cheese and terrible for you. Oh yeah. Whereas Italian pizza is like fancy Italian food kind of pizza. Oh, okay. So it's like I've margarita never... pizza and shit like that. It's like that's... Oh yeah, okay. Yeah, where it's like it's okay, but it's I don't know, it tastes bland to me. Right. I, I have the same maybe I just have eaten the wrong Mexican food, but like authentic Mexican food doesn't have as much spice as like american mexican food <laughs> right it's weird like maybe i'm just eating the wrong kind or something i'm, I'm, I'm sorry bell. if i'm offending well no not taco bell but just <laughs> like in general yeah it's like i've eaten like authentic like tacos and it's like wow this taco meat is like 
There's not a lot of like kick to it. Right. It tastes good, we but it's not, our, it doesn't have the same kind of spice. We got our packets of Lowry salt that we <laughs> throw oh, in. Oh yeah, oh yeah, because we, you know, we we fatten everything up, so of course it's gonna taste better because it's full of lard and fat and grease. I'm hungry. <laughs> right. <laughs> uh, my tiny little beam. It takes two. <laughs> Sam says. A timestamp, and then Ooh, I love this channel. I think we gotta click that. Yeah, one, what man. made Sam love this channel? Well, let's find out. Is this my ex girlfriend? Even <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's an, it's ad. an ad. God Turn damn it! it off. <laughs> don't listen. These never get monetized, so these don't have ads. Ah, uh, I've got a bishop. Oh. He's gonna touch me inappropriately. <laughs> We're playing. What a non. What a weird non we're, thing. We're doing the chest. Yeah. <laughs> It's just like, that's not even like, that was just like an aside I threw in there. Right. I'm glad you liked it, though. It probably just like <laughs> struck their fancy. Right. And was like... <laughs> Wasn't expecting it. Oh, yeah. man. <laughs> oh, well, no problem, Sam. <laughs> I hope you're not my ex. That'd be weird. Uh, if I could turn back time, it takes two. Thomas the Crunk Engine says, man, that's a visceral and committed murder sequence for a uh, spoiler, I guess. These are all like, if you're watching the comment show. It's gonna be spoilers. We should probably just start yeah, saying I that guess. up top. That's true. That's a visceral <laughs> and committed murder sequence for a cutesy and lovable plush doll, which is specifically your own child's best friend. That seriously cements this couple as seriously bad people. Seriously. I get that they deluded themselves into thinking that this would solve their problems, but the solution they came to was murder. Red flag, to be honest. Well, just how it happened. I mean, like, if that's what they thought was the solution but, then fine cut its head off but it was like the way that it happened where it was just like it was like brutal. fighting back and they're like ripping its arms off and yeah like, like just cut its head off and they're like ripping it limb from take limb its first batteries out or the, and, yeah <laughs> like knock it off the shelf so it like the plastic in the middle breaks right That's, they slowly butchered that thing yeah but then when she's crying they're like because he replied to himself and said yes she's crying a perfectly rational insane parent <laughs> yeah. That's because, like, she starts crying and they start, like, bathing in it and, like, dancing and, like, shaking their asses. Yeah, right. Like, yeah, we did it. And they're like, oh, no, it didn't work. Right. Like, you would think they would be, like, you know, remorseful. Like, devastated. Like, this sucks that we we had to do this. Yeah. I I can't even, like, ever since I had a kid, I can't even watch things that have other people's kids sad because it makes me want to cry. Yeah. Like there's a there's a scene near the end of Breaking Bad where like there's a little girl and she's like sitting there crying and going mama mama yeah. and I'm just like I can't even watch it now like no, I watched it's... it before I had a kid and I was like oh whatever but yeah. now I watch it I'm like oh whenever no. there's stuff where like <laughs> yeah or they're like their parent is dead or you know hurt or they're like sitting lost yeah they're sitting there crying it's like oh, I can't watch this. Yeah, it's it's <laughs> it's rough, but it's like these two are just like I don't care about my kid. Let's make her cry. <laughs> yeah. uh, lots of Muna, Muna, Monica, Muna, Monica. I love the Muna. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. I need to sing that as er, the Monica voice. Yeah, I love to sing. Uh, that's what it is yeah. about the Muna and the Juna. <laughs> uh, Volpe <laughs> says someone's throat is going to be sore half a day. Yeah, because that was where oh, you had to. Yeah, you were you were switching between being Monacuma and being. Uh, Sakura, but then you were also being Monokuma as Sakura. <laughs> Sakura. Yeah, and it was also a late night recording. Oh God, yeah, that was rough. And the entire episode was Mon- Monokuma talking, so it was like, oh God, I'm done. Yeah, yeah, it's like you were like constantly just like, <gasps> <laughs> yeah, I was drinking milk. <laughs> so I didn't sure, have water. Yeah, that'll real that, that'll <laughs> thicken up your mucus. <laughs> oh God, it's almost as bad as a shot of content in the mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Matt Barker. <clears throat> says same video i'm like 95 percent sure i mentioned the hint prompt in the comments but maybe this was the place where i missed that tip on oops what maybe we like didn't we missed something we're like oh god we why didn't anyone have... tell us or you know oh we did yeah, yeah i don't know what, what it was, was. It? i can't remember either but we was like we were like of all the things you guys we were just joking but yeah. like of all the things that you guys comment nobody told us about this we're mad at you oh yeah i'm oh, sure <laughs> I mean, we just do that. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the art of not thinking. I'm trying to like get through these because we're already like 30 minutes into the. Oh, episode. that's not as bad. It's as not I as bad. Though. Like I was worried this was going to be like an hour and uh-huh. a half or something. But we're getting we're getting. I mean, we through. wasted 10 minutes talking about random garbage. Well, that's what we do. <laughs> this is like the only time we could do that. It's either this or we do it at the beginning <clears throat> of an Otaku Tuesday, and people yeah. are like, "Just get to the game uh-huh. already." We already watched you're your ads. Only, yeah, you're only halfway through. <laughs> Play the game. <laughs> 
Uh, Art of Not Thinking, Cadawa Shoujo, Ren Route, Episode 3. Johnny Sun says, Ooh. you both are absolutely hilarious, but they're... Oh. Oh. Is this the... This is it. This, this is, is the one you mentioned. This is... I replied to this and said, this is my new favorite comment. And this is not me <laughs> being, like... I'm not being facetious. I pinned this comment. Yeah. Because I love, like... <laughs> I, I'm going to have to soapbox about this for a minute. Okay. Speaking of... Ta- this is why this episode is going to take forever. So here's what he says. Johnny Sun says... If you're here, Johnny Sun, don't take this as an attack, but I am taking your comment as an attack. <laughs> you both are absolutely hilarious. Thank you. But there is no depth in your videos. Oh, no. Fuck, that's the one thing we were going for. <laughs> Kadawa Shoujo requires at least basic understanding of psychology, and your comments are pretty narrow and primitive. Yeah. All right, well, let's... It's could probably, I mean, yeah, because we joke about blindness and... Here's the thing. <laughs> it's I watched a bit of the video... And it's to like get context, yeah, to yeah. get the context of it, and it's just like the art teacher showing up for the first time at the beginning of the Ren round in Act One. Okay, because like we had locked in Ren at that point, I was say, but it's still the Act Rin, One. Ren round, yeah, and like we were just like, you know, we're making jokes about the art being not great, like the mural is like stupid looking, and uh, blah 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 blah. Yeah, and it's first off, top of the top of the thing this is a comedy channel (laughs) yeah (laughs) like we're not genuine about like i'm not genuinely being like oh blind people are hilarious they can't see and blah blah you know (laughs) it's no we because we kept like in the in katawa hasau would like cringe every time he thought or like saw thought or said the word see or something yeah oh yeah it's like all right you don't have to be that yeah who gives a shit yeah (laughs) so then we just started joking like that like you'll see uh." yeah but i just i love this comment so much because it's it's something like i i i'd like to it's it's very much a defense mechanism like he starts out the comment with you both are absolutely hilarious which is like oh thanks yeah. But it's but. like, it's almost <laughs> like he did a compliment sandwich, but he forgot the bottom bun. Right. Because he's like, compliment, rip on us, no second compliment. You're supposed yeah. to do a second compliment to hide the fact it's that you're a, ripping on us. Whatever it's called, a, a neg, where they compliment yeah. you, but then... But it's also, it's this defense mechanism, and it's like, something you that... You look really cute for someone with your body shape. <laughs> <Right>? <laughs> yeah. What? Whoa. <laughs> I said you were cute. Now sleep with me. Yeah. Take this content in your mouth. <laughs> But uh, it's 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 a weird defense mechanism that like super like fanboy fangirl people in fandoms do. Yeah, because it's huge in like uh, what's the, what's that a lot of things. What's that show? Rick and Morty. Yeah, is like a good example of that. It's like gatekeepy. Yeah, it's not just gate <laughs> gatekeepy because it's it's like oh if you don't like this, it's because you're not smart enough to understand it. It's like <laughs> right. I can just not like something. But because they like it, this person obviously really likes Kadawa. Yeah. But because we're making fun of it, even though we're not actually, like, in a malicious way saying this sucks or anything, we're making jokes. He's taking that as a personal attack. It's like, well, if he's joking about this and I like this, that means he's making fun of me. Right. So the defense to that... Like if we were to make fun of a waifu. Yeah. 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 The psychological defense to that is, well, you're, you're a lesser than... So your opinions don't actually matter. Uh-huh. So that's what he's saying. We're too dumb to understand basic psychology. Well, I just dropped some fucking <laughs> basic psychology on your ass about your fucking comments. So how about that, <laughs> <Yeah>. bitch? <laughs> I don't care. I actually do like this comment because it's funny to me that he's just like, you guys are hilarious, but <laughs> yeah. you, you, you don't. You just don't understand. You don't get it. Right. It's like, oh, you're right. Which, yeah, I mean, at this point. This was like one of the last routes we did. Yeah, and it's just we're we're not trying to like, like I think it was, I mean majorly established at this point that we love this game. Obviously, and- <laughs> it's like our most like popular playthrough. We talk about it all the time. We reference it constantly. Yeah, we we love this game. We're not <laughs> ripping on the game. We're literally making jokes because this YouTube channel is about right. us making jokes it's, while playing it, a game. It's like the hair arms thing. It's like. <laughs> Cause, <laughs> we're not making fun of like the fact that there is a mistake. It's just it's funny <laughs> that there is a mistake, right? Like it's not us going, oh, that's funny because this person's an idiot. Yeah, this playthrough like, sucks, and the author is stupid. Yeah, it's, no, it's, it's you. You took the time to make this, you know, VN or this to write this, and it's awesome that you did. It it's also just the, the hair arms thing caught yeah, me off guard. Picturing <laughs> hair arms is hilarious to <laughs> right, us. Right, we're not making fun of. 
I don't know. But I understand. You know what I it's, mean. It's a defense mechanism. It's literally <laughs> this person. I wouldn't say. I, I don't know. Like I'm not trying to lessen you. But I'm not trying to turn it around. <laughs> but you get into a fandom, and if you make it part of your personality, when someone says they don't like it, your natural instinct is to take that as an attack on your personality. Right. Because you go, well, this is something that and I then, enjoy. And I, then you I, just don't understand it, so... Right. It's like, well, that's because you're an idiot. <laughs> right. It's like, no, it's... People can like other different things. And it doesn't that's, even really apply here because it's not like we don't like Catalog. Yeah. We just make the jokes because that's why we do this channel. That's like it's the Fate series, the anime. Yeah. I hate that show. And it's like one of the biggest... Animes yeah. like people but you can love just it. Not like it. I, I don't, just, I don't, I don't like, like it. I don't like Rick and Morty. I, I've <laughs> right. seen a couple episodes and I laughed a few times, but I'm just like, it's okay. That's I, whatever. Yeah, I watched the entire thing because I just I wanted. But to. it's not because I don't understand it. It's just like I'm not into it. You and know, it's like there's funny moments, but I don't really. I I never have to watch it again. Yeah, and honestly, we have to take that kind of thing into account because <laughs> we played like Undertale. We didn't play much of it. But yeah. even before we started, we're like, should we do this? Because we know Undertale <laughs> we has know this the... huge fandom. <laughs> uh-huh. And if and we've gotten it in other visual novels where like we do a voice for a character and they're like, someone will comment and be like, I don't like the voice you picked for this. I don't. This right. Is... So that's their waifu. Yeah. And, and it's or... like, okay, I'm sorry. That's you're if you're on this channel to watch the game and not watch us, then you're here for the wrong reasons, I think. <laughs> Right. Not to say you can't stick around, because I hope you enjoy what we bring. And this guy did say we were funny, but it's yeah. just, it, it just cracks me up that it's like, you need to understand basic psychology to understand this game. And it's like, it's a game about fucking crippled girls. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> like, I mean, it's not just that, but it's a, it's an anime visual novel about disabled it's girls. It's lighthearted anyways. I mean, yeah. for, most, for the most part, there's deep moments but i mean there's a scene where a girl has you put lemon lube on your dick and stick yeah, it in her and ass and then literally is like immediately that's a mistake yeah <laughs> it's like oh god it's it, you, <laughs> you can't take it that seriously but i just i pinned that because that like we never get like hate we never get like outward hate and even this is like not like outward like you guys fucking suck <laughs> right. but it's very much like you guys just you're making these jokes because you're idiots you don't understand yeah i agree we are idiots but that's not, we're not maliciously making fun of something. No. Just calm down. <laughs> I know you're probably not here, Johnny Sun. Maybe you quit watching after that, but they're just jokes, man. It's okay. You can make fun of things and still like them. Correct. That's perfectly normal. That's why I make fun of myself all the time. Yeah, well, I don't like myself. I was going to say, that but example. that doesn't work because I hate myself. <laughs> 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 this analogy oh, doesn't God. work at all it's just falling apart <laughs> but yeah that was i just i found that so fucking funny <laughs> all right let's move on from that crash sonic sonic adventure dx God, the black and death sonic yeah i was wondering why you guys haven't played this game it's going to be a fun playthrough i yeah we're we're gonna play some more of that tonight or today at some point because <laughs> yeah. we only did three episodes and i wasn't gonna actually start it until after segments yeah, but we thought our, about not. Yeah, and then our scheduling was like kind of jacked up. So I was like, well, I'll just upload them. But now there's been like a huge gap, and I'm like, God, I want to get back to <laughs> I know, it. know, right. There's been a huge gap in everything, though. So we're we're definitely playing catch-up today. <clears throat> uh, Come on, Arlene, Garfield Lasagna Party. <laughs> Rad Coffee Man says, the title of the song, Come on, Eileen, doesn't have a comma. Just saying. <laughs> well, dude, fuck you, then. <laughs> <laughs> that's actually interesting, because I thought it did. Yeah. And that's why I... No, because the song isn't about telling... Ar- Eileen to come on, it's about shooting a load of content onto Eileen. <laughs> right, fresh content. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Pineapple on pizza content. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I thought it did. Yeah, it would make sense, but... I mean, I, I, like, I thought I had like actually seen it before, but yeah. apparently not, because then I looked it up, of course. I'm like, oh shit, it doesn't. Yeah, well, whatever. But It works for the... Because the joke was us saying, come on, Eileen. You know, then, r- yeah, right. Whatever. It's a, it's a title. Who cares? Now I'm getting defensive. Bakugan's Bloodlust, Dong and Rampa, episode 16. Catherine says, I love the different names you keep giving Bakugo. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we got it. I we, love that his keep... default name isn't even his normal name, <laughs> but that his default name is Bakugan. <laughs> yeah. well, like, if we can't think of something, we just say Bakugan just instead Bakugan. of Yakuya. <laughs> yeah, because Bakugan's easier to say. <laughs> Yakuya is so hard to say. But yeah, it's... <laughs> It's it's so 
it's so funny too to like listen back to those or like watch those and like you see the text come up and then we start reading and one of us and then all of a sudden we're just like uh yeah and you're just like bailey and then i'll like default to brad something nine times out of ten yeah i just i don't want to just call him whatever his name is we did that in uh fruit of grisaia too did we the purple haired girl Sakaki. Oh, yeah. We kept saying different S names. Well, or, or we would just do like nonsense, like Saka <laughs> Kaka Goo Goo Goo. Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> it's like, apparently that's a thing now. Well, I just one I, character I feel us. like I feel like that's prefer, preferable to us, like, mispronouncing it on accident it, constantly. Because yeah, then we right. have people constantly be like, you're saying that wrong. You're saying that wrong. That's not how it's. I like. mean, I guess, but I feel people didn't really do that in Kadawa, like with Shizune. Yeah, that's true. Like, Sakura, yeah, got me like for the longest time because there was like Sakura games, like visual mm-hmm. novels, like Sakura something or whatever. Yeah. And I would always say Sakura, Sakura, Sakura yeah. and I'm like, that can't, that's not right. I right, but it's like Akira and Akira, like you, you know what they're talking about. It's, it's just fine. we we <laughs> say it with our yeah English inflection. Yeah, with our stupid English. It's like I try words. to like pronounce it the way it's supposed to, but it just occasionally a shizune pops out. Yeah, shizune. <laughs> shizune. <laughs> she yeah, right. Yeah, it's, it's whatever. It is what it is. It's Bakugan. <laughs> uh Colors of the Wind, Sonic Adventure DX. Thomas the Crunk Engine says Sonic says sounds like a perverted version of Simon says. <laughs> yeah, we said something about like Simon or Sonic says that's yeah. no good or Sonic something like says. that. Sonic says. Yeah, because yeah, that was I if I don't know, this is aging us. Not that we're not all obviously old anyway. But the old, yeah. was it the, the was it the Urkel cartoon? The original. Well, the very first one, Adventures of Sonic the Hedgehog. Yeah, the silly one with Scratch and Grounder. Yeah, that was the one that was, he was voiced by Jaleel White. Jaleel yeah, well, White. He, he voiced the first three. Oh, did he? Sonic, and that's just the one I always he, think of, is that that's the silly one, that one the, the more Urkel serious one. one with Freedom Fighters, and then... Sonic Underground. It was all Julia White. Oh, was it? I yeah. Just, I, whenever I hear that he was a Sonic voice, I always picture yeah. that one. The Sonic <laughs> Says one. Because it was like a G.I. Joe type of thing at the end of the episode. was like, Sonic says bullying is uh-huh, bad. Yeah. Or, Don't get into vans with strange people. Or, right. So, like, that's where that comes from. So, that's that's where I was saying <laughs> that be it with our craft Sonic. Yeah, because Sonic, Sonic says if the pussy ain't tight. <laughs> that's what it was. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It ain't right. Yeah. <laughs> like, Sonic. Yeah. <laughs> Crass Sonic is a good character. <laughs> he is. Keep him coming back. Uh, the Black Cadet, the adventure of Sonic the Crass Hog will never not be funny. Keep it up, guys. Yeah. Oh yeah, God. Yeah. I definitely want to keep doing crass things. It's just it's just an excuse for us to be like those guys that we aren't those guys. <laughs> yeah. But it's so funny. To, yeah. <laughs> to pretend. And, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, you'll find out my type. Smasher past Pokemon trainers. Where is Lily? Says Unvault the Secrets. Was she there? wasn't on there. She no. wasn't? I don't know which one Lily Her mom is. was. Oh, yeah, from Moon. The one yeah. with the hat. But yeah, her mom the was on there. blonde girl that has like an Alolan Vulpix and can't touch Pokemon. I don't, I've never played the game. I just know I've seen her, the blonde-headed girl with the hat. Yeah. And, and her mom and is she like has the Nebby. same age as her. She's like, get back in the bag! I don't remember. Yeah, I've never <laughs> I, played Well, I'm just, that's no just idea. like a meme. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I don't. I, I guess she wasn't on it. We didn't make it. That's the thing. Like... No, we did. The only tier list that we made was the one about our playthroughs. The rest of them were like, "Oh, we found them," and it's like, "Oh, this looks like a comprehensive list." Yeah, but no, she wasn't on there, which is weird because I think the other two were. Oh, yeah. Mallow and what's her face, Lana. Yeah. Well, let's let's clear the record. Smash. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, somewhere you can die. Sonic Adventure DX. <laughs> Thomas the Crunk Engine, timestamp. What actually happened is that in addition to misogyny, Sonic also dabbles in hardcore jug- drugs. <clears throat> the entire sequence he just went through in the pinball machine was just one big fucking trip. Yeah, that, yeah, was, that, was, the, that was the nights Going section. through nights. Yeah, there's that weird like, well. And then afterwards where it was just like, where am I? That and then was you wind it. up it in was the like, bathroom. Like you did the, we did the, the nights part. And it was like, okay, that's part of the pinball machine. But then, like, when I quit the pinball machine, I ended up in the sewers. Yeah. And it was almost like you were doing a level. Yeah. And I had, like, all these rings I was desperately trying to hold on to because it had all my winnings. Uh, Fall Guys. Oh, we're on to Segmas (laughs) now. Fall Guys, single episode games, first day of Segmas. Hey, Jason says, Angry Beam needs to be a thing. Yeah, anger angry beam is a thing. is a thing. Beam anger is real. <laughs> like I explained, beam anger in that, so. and it always starts with a 
cool yeah it's or either, that's it's, great yeah it's cool <laughs> that's great this is fine <laughs> <laughs> like that's it's like that defeated like it's defeated sarcasm is, is the best yeah. is the best explanation for it because it's like you're angry but you're not like outwardly like fuck this you're just like oh whatever yeah i'm having a great time yeah exactly and then the second things turn around, you're like, "Oh, I am happy to be here." Piece of shit. I think it was it was a different thing. It was worms. Worms was so, definitely yeah. a prime example. Oh of, yeah, the the I'm worms fun now. The worms WMD has like I even call you out in the episode because <laughs> yeah. you have the beam anger, and then something one good thing happens to you, and you're like, "Oh, this is okay." And it's yeah. Like you son of a bitch. <laughs> you're the worst. Yeah, it's like I'm not having fun unless I'm winning. But. <laughs> it's like I'm gonna, I hate you. <laughs> I mean, I don't. You know, <laughs> but that—that's beam anger. So if you haven't watched that Fall Guys episode, go ahead, and that is the—that's—that's that's a good example of beam anger too. Uh huh. It's just like if things are going your way, you don't. It's not like, I mean, I explain in the episode. It's not like other people playing a video game getting angry. It's not like fucking. This is yeah. cheating bullshit game. It's just like oh. Uh-uh. Whatever, but I hate, I hate this. It's just stupid, yeah. butt face. <laughs> yeah, it's it's just like a it's yeah it's it's dejected sarcasm. Uh, Shinobi three. Oh god, this, <laughs> this was probably my favorite one from segments. Honestly, I think so. Single episode games, third day. <laughs> Thomas the Crunk Engine timestamp. Oh, okay then. <laughs> yeah, that timestamp is you say ninjas. Ninjas. Yeah. yeah. We were just saying ninjas we in a always, funny way. Yeah. And then he said, LOL, that reminds me of the Bob's Burgers joke, what's up, my knitter? I've never seen that show. I've seen, I think I saw like the first two seasons, and I really like it. It was just, it's one of those shows that like, I didn't have, it's on Hulu or something, or was on Hulu. It might be on Disney now. I've heard it's good. Yeah, it's, I I enjoyed it. It's funny. I just never like sat down and watched it, watched it. Right. But yeah, we were, it was just like, whoa, better be careful with that (laughs) word. (laughs) Yeah. And then I came up with a new, <laughs> yeah. new one, yeah. And that one's probably going to stick around. Yeah, I'm sure I'll use that again. <laughs> when we get mad. Yeah. Uh, Speedrunners, <laughs> fourth day of Segmus. Thymic says, I love Speedrunners. It's a fun, casual group game. Well, I'm sorry we ruined it for you because we're really bad at it. <laughs> yeah. We did okay, I guess. No, it was fun. Yeah, it was a good time. Uh, Death Smiles 2, seventh day of Segmus. Thomas the Crunk Engine, <laughs> timestamp. There's no way any man could say no to that. I remember what it is, but I'm going to play this. Okay. It's, it's it's good. All right. I don't I don't remember this. Oh, oh it's probably going to be an ad. No! Ah! <laughs> okay, I'll go to the <laughs> next on. one while you fight. Okay. okay. Uh, no Place Like Home Base, Summer's Clover, episode four. Nick Vasquez oh. says no part three. Yeah. Did it get the, I did not re-upload those. Oh, sad. I know. And it says translate translate to English. <laughs> I know, I saw that too. So I clicked it and it says not part three. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no Google. That's... I think it was good the first just, time. Just his last name is Vasquez. I don't it's fine. He's probably typing on a like Spanish keyboard or something. Maybe. And it's like automatic. But yeah, because like that was when um uh, we were just about to get monetized, and I was going through and re-uploading oh, the Catawba. Yeah. Um, some of those Summer's Clover ones, I was like watching them. I'm like, God, these are really graphic. It's like That's I'm true. just going to completely drawings, delete like, them. Yeah, because those the sex scenes, like it goes into detail. It detail. does, and we we you know we say the words. I was like, I'm just going to delete these. It's like I kept all the original Catawba ones, but these ones, it's, yeah, I don't know. Maybe I'll re-upload them at some point. Well, but and we've talked about. It's just going to be a complete cut, I think, or I'm not even going to try yeah. to. Yeah, we've talked about in the past doing like a Patreon thing where we upload, <coughs> like we put like download files for uncensored versions of videos and stuff. So yeah. maybe we put that in like a file and like give That's it to true. Patreons make or a, something. Make an unabridged. Of, yeah, because that could that. be something we could give to like even the low tier patrons and shit. Right. Just like here's a here's a we just do like file box. And they can just like click that link and download it and watch them mm. whenever they want, as long as you don't upload them yourself. Though I guess we just we would get pinged for copyright on that. Yeah, because it would tell <laughs> us if you uploaded them. Not that I think any of our patrons would do that. Here's the. Uh, there's no way any man could say no to that. Oh yeah. What you, for what? If they were like, oh, I, I want, sh- I want your your dangly bumpo. And- <laughs> No, you're 20. 
<laughs> a 20 year old one in your dangly bumpo. I, I, I clicked on that timestamp. <laughs> I was like, dangly bumpo. <laughs> You're telling me That's... if a 20-year-old came up to you and said, I want your dangly bumpo, if... you would say no. Oh, my God. Can we do a series where I go to clown college and I, my clown name is Dangly Bumpo? <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I got to play that because Dangly That's Bumpo amazing. is amazing. Well, my first thought was it was like the, because I remember at the end of that, we were talking about like the girls arguing who had the better tits. Yeah, and then like the oh, the fucking giant angel with the huge rack comes out. I was like, I have the best, <laughs> right? <laughs> I was like, no. Oh my god, yeah, I didn't dangly bumpo. I don't even remember saying that. <laughs> uh, Death smiles too. <coughs> seventh day. Blackadette says, "Congrats, you got the etchy ending." Yeah, you said perfect for a Tuesday. Yeah, we could. We didn't understand what they were saying, but I guess no. we picked the right. Choice. Somebody did. Yeah, I saw... Later, we're about to get to it. Yeah, it's up higher. We'll get to it. Uh, N+, plus, fifth day of Segmas. Hey, Jason. Timestamp, the beginning of a book in gaming fanfic. I do want... Yeah, click that, yeah, click that one because, say. like, he's talking... There's a specific thing we do say, but right at the timestamp, <laughs> we start saying things, and it if out of con- it's perfect for an out-of-context. Like, because you do those out-of-context videos, uh-huh. it... Uh, I'm, because I, I remember clicking this one and being like, wow, that is <laughs> yeah, that's... really dirty if you, uh-huh. if you take it out of context. I hate this. Do you want to trade? Mm, no. Okay. Maybe? I mean, it's, it's, I'm, I'm, I'm cool with just waiting up here. If you want to touch my sweaty controller. Oh, I don't care. Mine's probably sweaty, too. Keep going. <laughs> Run it again, Johnny. <laughs> think I mind touching your sweaty appendages at this point? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I missed that one. Oh, no. Oh. That was. Oh it's just, God! It's like <laughs> I, I'm pretty sure he's just referencing the touching the sweaty opinion, but all the yeah. build up to that is like you want to switch. I, I could be on top. But yeah. like, oh, Jesus what? Christ! <laughs> right. <laughs> oh like, man! You want to touch my sweaty controller? <laughs> yeah, it's just Jesus. Out of context, that's pretty rough. Uh, Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom three, eighth day of Segmus. This actually did better than I thought. Like, I was looking at <laughs> yeah. the views on our segments video. It's like, wow, people, like, I mean, people like Marvel vs. It also Marvel. had, like, I had to delete two fights out of it. Really? Yeah, because that was the one where the audio oh, messed that's up right. randomly. That's right. But. Because we ended up, like, re- redoing, like, a, we had to, like, fix a bunch of shit for segments. That's why our scheduling messed up, and we ended up, like, missing a day of Dongan. Yeah. Because, like, we didn't have enough time, because, look. Like, <laughs> One of our videos completely messed up, and then this one had a mess up. It was a pain in the ass. Uh, Azuwaru the Cat says, If you haven't yet, check out Tampa Never Sleeps and see how this game looks when played by some of the best players. Oh, I see. It's wild how fast <laughs> and chaotic can, it can be. It, yeah. yeah, I mean, I every so often I'll watch like fighting game clips of like the best players. And sometimes it's really cool to like watch it, but other times it's like two people picking the exact same characters and never getting a hit in. Which in right. itself is cool, but it does get boring when they're doing the exact same thing. Because that, to me, is like, oh, the way to be the best at this game is to play it exactly how you're supposed to. Like, yeah. you might as well just, like, not even look at the screen and just follow a guide of what button to press at uh-huh. what time. Yep. It's like, I just want to mess around with random characters. I can never get that heavy into... I've talked about that with, like, Pokemon. Yeah. Where it's like, if you don't use this exact team, then you're not playing Pokemon oh, correctly. Yeah. It's like, I, I will, I will forever hate Twitch for ruining video games. <laughs> I mean, it wasn't, yeah. it wasn't, but that's like the last <clears throat> nail in the coffin of like a game comes out or a game gets updated and everybody runs to Twitch to see what the streamers say the new quote unquote meta is, right. and then all of a sudden everybody's using the same gun, everybody's doing, yeah, it's and then, like, and then things get nerfed because, yeah, yeah, and it's like, like Call of Duty to go as basic as possible call of duty has like so many different guns right but everyone's like yeah you should just use this one or this one those yeah. are the only two viable ones <laughs> it's like i don't want i want to use other stuff uh-huh. but then it's like oh i i lose because i'm not using the meta weapons yeah it's like that's not fun to me no like i want to just play the game uh rant over sorry death smiles 2 okay this is the one we were talking about Seventh day of Segmus. Mario135 says, I didn't bother reading all the text, so I guess he knows Japanese. Yeah, because we mentioned, like, if somebody can at least has a basic understanding of Japanese, please tell us what's going on. Yeah, but from what (laughs) I gathered, Santa stole the wishing notes in the beginning. After you take the last note from Santa back, God appears, because why not, 
and grants you one wish. Is God the one with the That's amazing rack? With the amazing rack, You yeah. wish for your grandfather slash the old man to be revived. The old man then asks if you could have any wish. That is where you choose that you do. The other option would have been saying no. Rosa wished to go to a beauty salon, and Lei wished to stay with the grandfather. So Lei and another character you didn't play as get adopted. Also, Lei, is that, am I even saying that right? Yeah. Is apparently a guy which really turned on Santa. <laughs> Just to put this fan service into another context. Okay. Yeah, okay. All right. <laughs> sure. <laughs> That's all right. That's fine. That age. Japan is so weird. <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> Understatement of the century. Yeah. Uh, we wish you a Merry Christmas. The final day of Sagmas. Catherine says, Merry Christmas. Yes. Oh, Merry Christmas to you. And Black Cadet <laughs> also says, Merry Christmas, you guys. Here's to another wacky year. <laughs> it's going to be wacky. I hope so. I Full hope of fresh content that we blast in your oh, mouth. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Open wide. <laughs> uh, single episode games, the game of life. Oh, this is a... <laughs> right? I love when we get comments like this. On, like, old shit? It's, yeah. Where it's just the most random crap. Well, because that just, it reinforces the idea that, oh, people are actually going back and watching old stuff. Yeah. Because I worry sometimes, because we have, like, 2,000 videos at this point, and it's like, are they only watching the stuff that we're <laughs> uploading now? Because there's some gems back in the day, you know? Uh-huh. Uh, Matt Barker says, this game was like my childhood, combined with the Clue slash Risk slash Skip Bow game. Fuck Skip Bow. Good nostalgia trip here. No, it was Phase 10 you hated. Oh, it was Phase 10, right. <laughs> God, fucking Phase 10. I played Skip Bow was, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just Uno. It's pretty much Uno, yeah. <laughs> but yeah, Phase 10, I've only ever played it once, and it was with you and your mom. Yeah. And you guys, like, fucking teamed up on me. I, re- I, I got, remember that. Yeah, I got fucking bent over and double teamed by Beam and his mom. <laughs> Take that out of context. <laughs> It was just so rude to be like, we'll teach you this game by destroying you <laughs> yeah. in it. Have you learned yet? I understand it, though, because it was probably just you two playing against each other for years. And the final, yeah. like, yeah, fresh meat. <laughs> right. Yeah. Rude. Uh, it's the wife. Wifecraft. Episode one. Thomas the Crunk Engine. Nice. The Minecraft YouTuber arc begins. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I guess, but we've already played you or Minecraft. That's true. It was just a podcast. And it was the same kind of thing where we were just wandering around aimlessly. I even mentioned in, yeah. I think I mentioned in the video, I was like, this looks dangerously close to the town. The only difference is like, I think our town in the the podcast one had more water surrounding it or something like that. Yeah. But it was ju- it was because we like used one of those like pre-rendered seeds. Oh, yeah. Where it's like, choose a village seed. <laughs> so it probably gives you the same kind of village every time. But yeah, we've played... Me and you played Minecraft before, but it was really just to have something on screen while we Right, because we didn't about... accomplish anything. I think we built a house. That was it. Like, yeah, we didn't really do anything and then I... we were just focused on chatting. Yeah, I think I was, like, starting to fix up a uh, path Probably. in a village. Well, I mean, if you But watch... there was a lot of, like, trying to talk, and I was just walking in circles, too. That's, I'd, I'd say <laughs> that when I'm playing with, I'm playing the, with my wife, and yeah. I'm just like, yeah, we're not, I'm not doing anything. Yeah. And she's like, I could play and talk at the same time, but then, like, an episode later, she's just like, yeah, I haven't done anything. Yeah. It's like, yeah, when you're talking, you don't realize, like, Minecraft's hard to play and talk at the same time. Right, and you would think it would not be. No, but it's just like, when you have a plan, it's hard to stick to it when your brain is thinking about something else. Uh, back to We Wish You a Merry Christmas. Golden Dude says that letter to Santa was perfection, just like gum. Gum Naughty is perfection. <laughs> Naughty or nice list doesn't matter if we have your son hostage, Santa. Yeah. I know. That was so good. I wish the like the, the Mad Lib stuff, more of it would have showed up on yeah. the response letter. It was still funny, but like <laughs> it would have been nice to have more than just the one thing. It of... could have just been like, I will try to get you... And then whatever you put, yeah. But the freaking it's like if you're good, is it you'll warm get and blank. constant agony. Yeah, that was just... good. Yeah, <laughs> that's great. Yeah. Uh, what the fuck? My phone is buzzing. Give me just a second. Oh, my. This, it's my wife telling me that the Grumps video today is ranking every breakfast food. <laughs> yeah, we saw it's that. It's funny, we saw that, and we're like, those <laughs> bastards, but everybody has done those. Like, right. we're not the first, we we weren't going to be the last. And I'm pretty sure it's the Sour Patch Kids. The cereal on their on thumbnail. The thumbnail. Yeah. So they did the same one we did. Of course, they probably had the same opinion on Sour Patch Kids uh-huh. cereal, too. We didn't watch it. Like, that sounds terrible, but I want to try it. <laughs> I do, too, just to, yeah. Just to, just to know. Confirm how terrible it is. Yeah. 
Uh, it means no worries. Dong and Romp episode 41 says, Happy late holiday Xmas, guys. Hope you and your families had a wonderful time. <coughs> yeah. Yeah, it was, it was fine. It was all right. It was Christmas. <laughs> like, Christmas as an old person isn't really the same. It's more about, like, did the kids have a good time? I was going to say, the, the gifting with my daughter was the good part. That's the it. The rest like, was boring. And... Yeah, it's like if the kids had a great time, then it's like, oh, cool. Yeah. Everything else is just like, yeah, it's just getting together with extended family and right. catching good up. Good food. Usually. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> pretty much. That's what it is. Uh, when Travis met Andrea, wife craft. Thomas the Crunk Engine says, I love how <laughs> when Travis loses his house again, wife has the best you have to be shitting me attitude. Like a mom that heard her kid did the stupidest shit imaginable. I wonder why that sounded familiar. <laughs> and then Black Adette replied, she got used to it. <laughs> yeah, yeah she did not find your house. Yeah, she definitely... Uh, <laughs> She's dealt with my nonsense for a long time, so she she knows. She knows. <laughs> like, I say some stupid shit. She's just like, okay, here we go again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see here. Cricket chirps and dragon burps. Thomas the Crunk Engine says, oh, I got a foot cramp. That's not what he said. Uh, <laughs> Timestamp, good thing Luigi wasn't in the crowd that time. Oh, that's when the dragon eats when, the crowd. Right, because we mentioned that it sucks that Luigi's not there Yeah, at the beginning of the yeah, fight. Yeah, but, the, the, but the, then all the, the crowd, fight. yeah. Because you replied, bro, this new avatar looks so beautiful in 3D. <laughs> it's like the dragon is coming right at me. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. Uh, <clears throat> I want to know what love is. That's why we were singing that earlier. Yeah. We both had that stuck in our head. I was like, why? where did that come from? Uh... Valtteo's timestamp. Oh God, it's Baku gone. Oh, yeah. I mean, if I if you want me to click on it, I can. But it's when you start before you establish a, a tech voice. Oh yeah, it I was Bakugani. like Bakugani. <laughs> yeah, well, because I was like just trying to like try a bunch of different voices, being like, what can I stick with? <laughs> yeah, because I want to find something that's different, but something that I can actually do without hurting myself. <laughs> right. So I don't want a Monokuma situation. <laughs> Uh, and then he edited it, said, there's no issue with the voices, just don't murder your vocal cords too much. Yeah. Too bad! <laughs> <laughs> there's no stopping us now. You were doing multiple things where we voice act every single character and yeah. try to make it as weird as possible. I like my Monokuma voice. It's great! <laughs> it's just, it destroys your fucking throat. Right. I'll destroy your throat. <laughs> Some content. Fresh <laughs> batch of salty content. <laughs> we're gonna be stuck on that oh, all yeah. night. Uh, Thomas the Crunk Engine. Timestamp, I think anger is a very easy to emotion, emotion to understand for a computer compared to love. Especially when you ask the pretty girl in front of you to teach you about it, and she says no and starts being difficult. <laughs> yeah. Cause we were, he, Thomas, do you got some issues with women? Because he, right? he was like, <laughs> I understand anger, that emotion, I understand. And we were like, how? Yeah, but it's like I you mean, don't understand. But yeah, it's love way is more simplistic than love. Uh, always let your conscience be your guide. Oh, Kadwa Shoujo Lily Route, episode 22. Yeah, that's that's the one where we talk about your conscience being your penis. That's right. Yeah. And I and then I say always let your conscience be your yeah. guide. Because we talk about it being like Pinocchio's nose growing. Voltiel, <laughs> it's like, please lie. Uh, yeah. <laughs> just leave a new comment. It's nice watching. Just leaving a new comment. It's nice watching these again. Well, I'm glad you're yeah. going through them again. So he must be watching them again. Yeah, you know, like <laughs> half the people on our channel are just like, oh, time to start Catalog. Again. <laughs> yeah. Fine by that's me. That's crazy. That, that's so weird to me. Oh, How awesome, I mean. I honestly, it's been a long time since I've seen them. I'm thinking about going through and watching them again. <laughs> yeah. Just finding jokes that we forgot we made. And... Yeah, because there are times when, like, <laughs> I, we get these comments and I'm like, I'm going to click that video. And then I start it up and I'm like, I kind of remember this, <laughs> but it's been so long that it's, like, fresh to me again. Yeah. There we go. Watch party. Where we just watch ourselves. Discord. Oh, Lord. Just watch us playing Katawa. Honestly, they might be into that. I, they might. It'd be weird, though. Yeah, that one we couldn't talk over, because there's no way I'm going to talk over myself. No. That'd be, like, that'd be impossible to figure out. Uh, completely wholesome, Katawa Shoujo Lily Rat episode 24. <laughs> Freaking YouTube, Altail says. That was, yeah. That, that was, was one I had to re-upload. Upload. Yep. And then the last one. Holy crap. We've been This, uh, this did take almost an hour and a half. Mm-hmm. I want to know what love is. Paper Mario. Hey, Jason says, we need a skit with you as Tech and Peach. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> I did like that bit of us like going back and forth on that. Yeah. But, oh, yeah. I mean, that is that's that is the Tech and Peach skit. There's going to be plenty of those <laughs> right. in yeah. that game. I, do, like, in real life, you mean? Yeah, it's like, am a... I, do I got to go sit in like a cardboard box and write Tech on the front of it? And then yeah. you walk in in a Princess Peach dress? <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, that'd be terrible. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> I definitely don't already own one. <laughs> no, I mean, if you want a, a skit from that, just someone make an animated. <laughs> an <something>. animated, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just like outwardly requesting people make animations, even though that's like a lot more work than oh we would God. ever put into it. Yeah. I don't know. Use Legos. <laughs> Do a stop motion. <laughs> That'd be awesome, too. Right? There, I don't any kind of There are art. grumps that are grumps animated that are stop motion like I've gumby seen, and... yeah i've seen stop motion ones and there's guys who do puppeteering <laughs> yeah yeah i i mean i'm not gonna go i'm not gonna be like oh you do this for us but fan art of any kind would just like blow my nuts off yeah we would like just explode a fresh batch of content it could literally <laughs> yeah, yeah in my pants <laughs> It would it, like it could be like a stick figure drawing with the names Travis and Eric over it, and one of us saying something from a video, and I'd be like, "Yeah, yeah that's a reference right. to us." I'd be so happy. What's crazy to me is like we had two people, two separate people, make three different covers of our outro. Yeah, song. the outro song back got when a we bunch had of stuff like literally eighty subscribers. Yep. Like, I th- well, it was people <laughs> from the Catawba subreddit, wasn't it? I don't think we had even played Catawba yet. Oh, I thought that's what it came I mean, from. it might have been. Because I know you were in contact with, like, the guy who had made all those, like, little Catawa sprites because we were using them. Oh, yeah, the like, the big Catawa artist. Yeah, so I, I asked just... if we could use some of their pictures for thumbnails and stuff, and right. they said yes, but... So I just assumed that, the like, the music was from people from that, or, like, the DDLC one, because we had played DDLC. Yeah, I don't... For some reason, it seems to me like that was even before then, but we played DDLC really early on. Yeah. But yeah, I don't know. It's weird to me, like, way back then, we had people like, oh, man, I want to do a cover of your outro song. Well, that's it. That, and that's the thing. Like, we we, we would be, we're, we'd be so grateful for anything like that, any kind of, like, fan art, even if it's, like, the smallest little thing, that we will constantly use it, because we still use those <laughs> outros, like, all yeah. the time. Um, one of them I use for every single um, best of. Yeah. The or the orchestral the, cover with Lukoshi. Yeah, think his name and is. then yeah. the music box one I use every segment. Yeah, yeah. That's that's just. I mean, if you've got, if you've, I mean, if you got some talent and you want to shoot it all over us, we we're ready to receive it. <laughs> 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 all right. Well, we've got a lot of recording to do. We got to play catch up, and it's a you know it's a new year, and we got to get some videos out. Yeah. So let's do it. Okay. Let's let's start like a bunch of new playthroughs and just abandon everything else we did last year. That sounds like a good idea. Yeah, to me. We're, we're not going to do except that. except for Sonic. I'll oh, play Sonic. right. Yeah. Well, Sonic was supposed to start with the new year, and anyway. <laughs> we fucked that up. All right. Well, uh, you know, let us just keep sending us comments. Let us know your favorite moments from last year. Right. And keep watching. Keep doing your thing. Keep 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 being people who watch stuff yeah here's to another six years of us sitting on your couch running out of air (laughs) (laughs) 